Hi everyone, my name is Abel Grey Kantuma. I'm from Greatest Card Design Concept. This is actually my WhatsApp contact. You can reach me on this number, you can call me, okay? Uh, these are the list of softwares which I have covered on our YouTube channel. They are very, very much available on that channel. Visit uh, the channel and actually keep yourself busy. Down below the description of this video, you'll find the link to that channel. Make sure you go there and actually keep yourself busy. We have covered architectural working drawings, structural designs and detailings, mechanical and electrical service drawings, water designs and road designs, okay? We now teach all of the softwares on our Telegram platform where we'll give you the software, we'll guide you on how to install it and how to crack it on your system uh, yourself, okay? For 40 days, okay? Just for the token, you can actually chat me up, okay? Or you can even call me uh, for more information about our trainings, okay? Uh, today, I'm going to be showing you how to actually come up um, with your uh, cantilever, okay? Uh, we're going to be having a cantilever stand uh, from our protest structure okay let's jump right into it i'm going to click on new and i'm going to make this cantilever I'm going to click on orthogonal and I'll click anywhere here and I'll click on OK. Okay, good, good. So I'm going to uh, select my steel column and then um, I'm just going to use this section that is actually here. Just want to make this as brief as possible. Okay, and then um, I'm going to draw a beam, steel beam. Okay, across this okay, good. so here at J I'm going to make it 1500 Make this 1500. Okay, good. Now let's have this on a on a both 3D and 2D. Okay. So I'll go to my view and I click on 3D. okay okay sorry this is actually not how i want this to be so i'm going to correct that so i'll come to my um okay i already have my 3d here i'm going to take this to the side Okay, good. So now I'm going to select these uh, beams. So I, I, I actually made a very big mistake here, but that can be adjusted. So I'm going to select my beams and I'll right click and I'll go to properties. And then um, here I'll select all of them and then I'll make here zero. Okay, and I click OK. And at the right side, I will make this um, 1,500, okay? And then I click OK. And then I close. Okay, good. I 
want this to actually slant a bit so um, I'm going to select them okay so let me just make this zero first okay good so now At um, the right, uh oh, I think. Oh, I typed that at the wrong place. Okay, so I'm going to make this 1500. Good, this is what I'm looking for. And then I close this. I can switch this back to zero. Just select all of my beams. Go to properties. <coughs> and I'll make this zero, okay? And then I close. Good. So I will switch it back to uh, go to properties. Uh, the left. I'm going to make it. Uh, 1500 okay so let's see good so i close this if you already like what you're seeing make sure uh you like this video give it a thumbs up uh subscribe to this channel it's actually uh 100 free uh click on the bell icon so as to always uh get a notification whenever i post videos i post videos like this on a weekly uh sometimes on a daily so as to encourage as many that want to have a deeper insight of design okay uh, so right now i'm going to be uh, placing a blue line on this if i click on this okay good Come register with us okay uh, so you can go to your building analysis you can do the analysis for uh, this uh, the structural uh, members for the steel members you can actually go to your edit material and actually choose uh, the steel uh, section you choose, choose for that of your beam you choose for your columns okay you choose for your guts you choose for your breeze and all click on OK okay always check your parameters okay you can use C for steel we are actually using uh, BS 5950 okay loading of uh, buildings loading for buildings are 6399 okay so uh, the foundation you can do all of those adjustments here okay title you can enter all of this here then you click on ok uh, you do your load combination okay uh, i'll advise you to uh, visit my channel uh, so as for you to see a few a full training which i have covered on uh, steel design okay on that uh, on this video i'm just focusing on the modeling so once you can model this you follow that process on my tutorial you should be able to come up with your design and their detailed drawings okay as well uh, make sure that you actually stay safe and make sure that you actually stay blessed okay so after doing all of this make sure you check on your steel member design check okay so if you do this you run this okay okay load cases and combination are not defined okay okay I have to come back to my load case. I have to load this. I have to load this. Okay, click on OK. I have gone through. I have run all of this before on my trainings. Okay, just visit that channel and actually 
uh, keep yourself busy once you run your analysis okay you just run all of your analysis here then come to your building model and check check if there be any error there is no error here so go to your post analysis okay after then you can actually just go to your portal uh, your portal still and then view for your connections okay 